Why is there a thing flashing? That's gonna bother me. Yeah, that's very distracting. Hello, guys. Got you, Wednesday, February 4th, 2015, Islamic State terrorists have brutally murdered a Jordanian pilot. I'm Zoe Tuttle. And I'm Murphy. What's a three-parent baby? We'll tell you. Your CSN News starts now. Islamic State group militants burned and captured Jordanian pilot to death in a cage, according to a video of the violent re violence released Tuesday. After confirming the pilot's death, Jordan vowed a swift and lethal response and then executed two Al-Qaeda prisoners by hanging early Wednesday. The pilot's gruesome death sparked anti-Islamic State group demonstrations in Jordan. The video emerged after a week-long drama over a possible prisoner exchange for a female Al-Qaeda operative imprisoned in Jordan. She was one of the two prisoners executed. Britain voted to, on Tuesday to become the first country to allow a three-parent inverto fertilization technique, technique which doctors will say will prevent some inheritable and curable diseases, but which critics see as a step towards creating designer babies. The treatment is known as three-parent because the babies born from genetically modified embryos would have DNA from a mother, a father, and a female donor. It is designed to help families avoid incurable conditions passed down the maternal line that affects around 1 in 6,500 children worldwide. An international science team has discovered a microorganism that has remained unchanged for over 2 billion years. Scientists claim this find is in line with what many scientists already consider as fact. The organism is a type of microscopic deep sea sulfur bacteria. Preserved as fossil in rocks found along the coastal waters of Western Australia, the samples are 1.8 billion years old. This bacteria closely resembles another bacteria found in the same region, but which dates back to 2.3 billion years. Apparently, once nature finds an organism that works, there's no need to fix it. We'll be right back. Want to see the Big Apple or tour the White House? Join the Nampa Trout Club. Any 9th through 12th grader in the Nampa School District is welcome to join. Be sure to bring your family. Included in the price are benefits such as airfare, hotel rooms, three full meals a day, a licensed tour director, professional overnight security, illness or accident emergency coverage, a monthly payment plan, and more. Sign up online and be sure to contact Mrs. Levi or Miss Dodge. If you have any questions, call 208-498-0551 or visit Mrs. Levi's Weebly page. Want more information? Look up the Nampa Travel Club on Facebook. Don't miss this chance to see the world in the 2016 school year. Today's weather is brought to you by Dr. Kim Keller. Your smile is your first impression. Make it a good one and visit Dr. Keller today. Today's high is 51 with a low of 38 with showers. Tomorrow's high is 52 with a low of 44 and cloudy. We are in competition with five other area high schools to have the most seniors complete their FAFSA by April 15th. The school who has the highest percentage of seniors file will receive an all-expense paid senior class graduation party at Wahoos in May. There will be a door prize drawing for all NHS seniors who complete their FAFSA prior to March 4th. NHS has two completion events to help parents and students file their FAFSA. The first event will be on Tuesday, February 10th from 6 to 8 p.m. in the NHS library. Refreshments will be served. Uh, please bring your parent and student social security numbers and your driver license numbers. Uh, parents and students must re I <laughs> parents and students must recent most recent federal income tax returns, W twos, and other records of money earned. Seniors, don't forget to contact D Davies at Butterfly nineteen fifty nine at yahoo.com or call nine one six. 459-0919 by February 10th if you and or your parents can help sell Scentsy products in March. We need all the help and participation we can get to make this as much to make as much as possible from this fundraiser. An awesome celebration is being planned for the graduates that you won't want to miss out. So please sign up to sell Scentsy and help out. Ladies and gentlemen, it's that time of the year for the 2015 Bulldog Brawl. The premier sporting event of the year will be held on Saturday. Doors open at 6 and fights start at 7. 
Tickets are on sale now. See Coach Cho or Coach Sanchez for details. Please come and support NHS Athletics and our amateur fighters. Valentine's Day is approaching and many of you don't know who your Valentine will be or if you've picked the right one. Thankfully, the speech and debate team is here to help you out by finding who your ideal match is. We will be selling your ideal match February 9th through the 13th during all three lunches. Make sure you know you picked the right Valentine before the big day comes. This week we will be having several colleges visiting our campus. Today, Boise State during all lunches. On Tuesday, there will be Washington State University, Tri-City, and on Friday, our visitors will be Montana State Billings. Today's SAT word of the day is deterrent, a noun that means which to deter or prevent. You could use it in this way. The tough new laws against graffiti were to in intended to be deterrent against vandalism. That's the news. We'll see you again tomorrow, right here on the Bulldog Edition.